Welcome to yellowmotor.com. We're here today at Blenheim Palace in the UK to test drive the new Range Rover PHEV E400E. The PHEV is uh, Range Rover's gambit into the uh, full-size plug-in hybrid SUV segment. It's powered by uh, Jaguar Land Rover's four-cylinder, two-liter Ingenium engine and an electric motor sandwiched between the gear, eight-speed gearbox and the four-cylinder engine. Naturally, being a Range Rover, it's four-wheel drive and fully off-road capable. And it's part of the revised facelifted uh, Range Rover range. Uh, there's been some cosmetic changes to it, starting from the grille, lights, and other changes around the side. The first of the revisions, the aesthetic revisions, is the grille. It's a new grille design. And with the PHEV, the charger is hidden behind the grille opening over here. The light, light clusters have been changed as well on the, uh, the new revised model. In terms of aesthetics, the, uh, the, the four slats or the four, um, the four extraction slats have been changed from uh, three to four sets. And from the rear, the biggest uh, or the main aesthetic change is the rear lights. It still retains the same vertical shape, but now has two square-like uh, cl clusters or pods on the inside. Right, we're still at uh, Blenheim Palace uh, with the Range Rover PHEV. We're driving in electric mode now. It's uh, silent, uh, smooth, and lots of torque, low end, uh, straight from zero RPM. The sort of uh, the sort of thing that you want in a big luxury SUV, a big 2.6 ton luxury SUV. It's all about uh, smooth ride, uh, refined experience. Uh, you don't want high revs. What you need for that is uh, lots of torque, low end, smooth, relaxing drive. The new Range Rover, like the old one, rides on a uh, on air springs with uh, double wishbone front suspension and integral rear suspension, uh, which optimizes it for the best handling and best ride quality. And Driving on the grounds here at the Marlborough Estate, uh, it seems to be taking the road uh, in a very smooth, supple sort of way, despite the fact that it's riding on 21-inch uh, uh, alloy wheels with uh, low-profile tyres. Driving, driving the PHV in uh, full electric mode at the moment, the, uh, the Range Rover should be good for uh, a range of 51 kilometres in ideal conditions. Um, Recharging time is about seven and a half hours on a conventional charger, whereas a high voltage charger it would take uh, two hours, 45 minutes. Um, and for, uh, for a car of this size and, uh, and height, the uh, PHEV is expected to return a combined fuel uh, efficiency of 2.8 liters per 100 kilometers. And, uh, and CO2 emissions are just 64 grams per 100, uh, 64 grams per kilometer. The Range Rover, well, it could uh, pull up through the uh, steep slopes easily with that much torque, uh, and and with the um, with the electric motor position between the gearbox and the uh, and the four-cylinder engine, it means the Range Rover uh, retains the same off-road four-wheel drive hardware. As the, uh, as the standard non-hybrid model. Uh, this includes the full mechanical four-wheel drive system with locking differentials, low gear ratios, and so forth, uh, which gives it extensive capability for off-road driving, unlike some uh, four-wheel drive hybrids, which uh, drive the rear, mo the rear uh, wheels with uh, an electric motor and the front with a petrol engine. With a comparable level of uh, off-road performance as the standard uh, Range Rover, the uh, Range Rover PHEV will wade through uh, 900 millimeters of water, uh, but Range Rover recommend that this is done with the, with the combustion engine switched on so that uh, water doesn't get in the exhaust system. Um, additionally, the PHEV has the same uh, electronic off-road assistance uh, suite, the terrain, uh, terrain response system, which modulates the uh, traction control, the uh, stability system, the suspension ride height, and the uh, and the mechanical differentials uh, again are electronically operated to optimize them for different driving situations, from ice and snow, 
mud and ruts and so forth. So to sum up, after the uh, off-road and on-road driving, uh, the, the Range Rover PHEV is, uh, is a fully off-road capable uh, SUV. It's smooth and comfortable on roads. It's, uh, the silent EV mode uh, completely suits such a luxury 4x4. Uh, it, it adds to its uh, level of refinement, at least when uh, when cruising and the interior is uh, more comfortable than ever with softer seats and more uh, improved uh, infotainment systems and uh, we'll be looking forward to the PHEV arriving in Middle East markets.